So you're looking to purchase your first suit. Maybe you need to look good for an interview or you have an event coming up. Either way, it's really easy to get overwhelmed with all the choices there are. So here are my top tips for when you go to buy your first suit. The first tip is to make sure that the suit you buy is appropriate for what you need. Chances are you aren't James Bond. So you can probably pass on getting a tuxedo as your first suit. You're also probably not fleeing bad guys through the streets of Miami in your Testarossa. So I probably wouldn't recommend getting a light colored linen suit as your first suit either. Secondly, you want your first suit to be versatile. A suit can be a big investment and with that you want to get the most out of it. A lot of people recommend getting a dark navy suit for your first suit, but I think a dark charcoal gray suit is an even better choice. So to demonstrate how extremely versatile a dark charcoal gray suit is, let's look at some examples. Here we have ourselves a solid charcoal gray suit paired with a white shirt, black tie, and a white pocket square. We have the perfect combo for a semi-formal or business formal event. If you want to stand out at your semi-formal event, go for a power look with a black shirt and a white tie. If we throw in a solid blue shirt and striped or geometric tie, we have a very classy business look that's perfect for interviews. If you need a more business casual look, we can throw in a pattern shirt with stripes or a check pattern and skip the tie altogether. For an even more casual look, we can swap out the suit pants for a contrasting color slack or even jeans and wear the jacket as a blazer. Tip three is to make sure that you get your suit tailored. Assuming that you're not getting a bespoke suit or having a suit custom made for you and instead buying a suit off the rack, you need to plan to have it tailored and budget for this. Off the rack suits are made to fit an array of people. So after finding a suit that fits your shoulder properly and is correct for your height, you'll want to have a tailor correct and fix other aspects of the suit to fit your body shape. Finding a great tailor and developing a good relationship with them can be the best thing for elevating your fashion and style. My next tip is to go classic. Go with a notch lapel as opposed to a peak lapel. A peak lapel is more formal and a notch lapel is very easy to both dress up and dress down. Also, unless your body is really suited for a three button jacket, stick with the two button jacket and single breasted as opposed to a double breasted jacket, which again is not as versatile as a standard two button jacket. Since this is your first suit, here's some basic guidelines to make sure that you look perfect in your first suit. Assuming you went with a dark charcoal suit, you'll want to wear black dress shoes or black loafers and a black dress belt with it. Wearing a watch with your suit can really elevate your look. It shows that you value your time and you also respect the time that others give you. But don't ruin this look by wearing some oversized sports watch or a casual active wear watch. If you're wearing your jacket buttoned, never button the bottom button. This holds true whether you're wearing a three button, two button, or double breasted suit, never button the bottom button. And when you sit down, completely unbutton your jacket, otherwise it's gonna box up on your shoulders. I hope this video is giving you a lot of information to help you buy your first suit. For more videos on elevating your fashion to its true form, check out this video here. Ciao.